Still listen to some house. I'll be right in a second. Gotta start a proper well and then start a proper listening to some house music mix there. It's a DJ Rowan, I think. I like DJ Rowan because he has a lot of bass in his stuff. I only got two of his gospel mixes. So I don't know, maybe he a gospel boy. Who knows? Okay, we're, as they say, off and running on a cold, well, whatever. Oh, guess I better stop this. Pay attention to you. Oh, Woo. hey, cool. oh, I'll, leave I'll be a main. I'll be a main. I'll be strong. Little chili kip just like being Maine. <laughs> Maine. You know, they, they say that in Memphis and down south, they say Maine. You know, like in all in the all south. They get so used to saying I think they get they go all wrapped up in it, man. They have they say it as a as a badge of like, hey, if I say this it means Maine, it means I come from here. This is where I was made. Oh, here I got my steps. Oh, let's let's tell you what it is. Oh wait, I gotta Take off airplane mode first, basically. Hold on a second. Hey, 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 hey. When I twist you, you twist. Thank you. Uh, let's see. 17,796 steps. That would be. Oh, wait. What's going on here with this? Let me see something here. Put this play. Oh, it's 30 seconds, of course. Idiots. Okay. Well, well now I got to go back to that. Damn it. 17,000. 796 steps. It means 11.92 kilometers or kilometers. I don't know. I never know how to pronounce that. 11.92. Then I got to go to the, the I got to go to the thing here. Did I say 11? 11.92 kilometers. K I L O. Meters are uh, in miles. M I L E S. I don't know if I put it that way. Oh, the airplane mode is still on. Oh, sorry. I thought I tweet you off. <laughs> oh, take the, that off too. Now let me go back. Oh, here he is. Tell me right away. Oh, so I can even if the even if the airplane mode is on, I can punch in the thing so it won't tell me right away. But as soon as it goes back to the internet or give me internet, then oh, learn something new every day. This is why I love being an evolutionary because that's an evolutionary, you know. This is my uh, I got this long time my buff thing. It's all wore out. I had to wear it this morning because I, I thought it was going to be cold and whatever. Else, so I want something for my neck, my neck, my necks, my necks, my necks. Okay, so that's a. Uh, 7.406744.61 miles. Seven and a half miles I walked this morning on a Friday morning. Okay? Or 11 point, or 11.92, almost 12 kilometers. You know, whatever. I like to say that better. Okay, that's done. Now let's get down to brass tacks. Don't worry, it's a Friday. I'm not going to keep it long because I know you'll be out partying and stuff like that or preparing to party or thinking about partying, whatever it is. So, uh, I'm still, well, I'm at the, at the end of this. Like I say, 
if a cold comes in my way, usually can't hang for more than three days. So it's the last day of whatever's going on. So I really went all in now. <laughs> I put now I got three tea bags. Look at this, three of them. This here is which one is this? This is the. This one is the. Come on. This is the. I don't even say. I think this is the ginger licorice. This, no, this is the licorice root. Straight up licorice root. I did that because I want that. This one here, this Buddha tea. Yeah, this is li li organic licorice root. Then you got the Buddha tea, which is a uh, turmeric and ginger tea, right? Then I got this really expensive whatever I got from this. Then I got the nylon bag, or as I'm saying this nylon mesh bag, and this little bit of thing. And this one I know is uh, licorice root and ginger. So I got turmeric and ginger, licorice root and ginger, and plain licorice root, all in a tea that continues to steep. Steep, I guess it's, I'm through steeping it. Okay, so I'll just deal with that in a second. Well, let me put it off over here. And I know I'm probably wasting a lot of tea, but you know, I don't really have a lot of. That's that's an interesting thing. I mean, I don't have a lot of. I don't. I don't have a lot of anything. I'm not materialistic. I don't have a lot of anything. There's something happened yesterday that's somewhat upsetting, but it's, it was so upsetting that it's absurd to me. You know, I came back, and let me put it this way: I had a, uh, I had a, um, have a beard comb that I got from uh, Kenya Air. You know, Kenya Airways, Kenya Air. There's a beard comb, but you have these big, uh, whatever, it's a beard comb. It, it unfolds, and you have a regular comb comb, and then you have a thing that's a little wider for a beard. There's nothing but a little black plastic thing. And it was missing. I said, well, it's my beard comb. And my sister says, oh, 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 sorry, I threw that out. Well, why'd you throw out a, a little innocuous thing like a why would what was you in my room throwing stuff out for that uh, it, it blew my mind I just I just couldn't fathom I couldn't fathom why anybody would throw it's just a little thingy why throw out my beard comb you know that's the thing here's the trick what I'm trying to say is that my possessions I have very very few possessions a lot of possessions I have is like very unique like Say something for, say for these headphones, right? These are really good headphones. Now, I got these headphones before anybody knew about these headphones. This is status audio headphones. See, there's no branding. You can't see no branding there or anything like that. It's very unique. It's very good, right? I got the earbuds for it, too. And I'm only going to take what happened with that. But anyway, but the point is, I got, I get stuff. I don't know how I get turned on to stuff, but it just comes my way, you know? Oh, it's still hot. I let that go. But it's just very strange, you know, and a lot of things like I can't even tell you the part of my life is a lot of technology, um, the, the, the one plus phones, you know, I found one plus before anybody, you know what I mean? I, I got it from a pop up store. I got it from a day after. Pop it's very wild. You know what I mean? And I don't know. I, I just don't know. So my stuff is very, very, it's like it, I'm, I'm, it's very unique. I've, stuff comes my way. I'm like. I'm like Stevie Wonder of gadgets, you know what I mean? I think the company should just send me stuff when it first comes out, and I'll tell you what's... Okay, never mind. Let's get on to that. Okay. Ah, I was trying to get that in my throat, the licorice in my throat. I don't really like licorice. I don't like licorice. But here's something I want to... Oh, I'll wait for the thing for that. Okay, so I'm ready. I'm going to let that... I'm going to let all that stuff. But here's what I thought. Let me tell you what I thought, because I'm not going to put this in my thing. I'm going to... You know, maybe, no, no, I won't, because that would incriminate people, right? Here's what I thought. Why would anybody get a beard comb? Now, if I look at my face, right, uh, right now, you know, I could groom up or whatever have you, and that would be fine, right? And I was looking at something, because I got the, the, the mustache there, and then I got the nose hairs coming out. But, like, you know, as an older person, if the beard, the beard, not the beard, the mustache meets the nose hair, that's a good filter for stuff to trying to get into your nostrils into your body so it actually is good that i don't have a beard comb you know or groomed or uh, it's not that's not true i'm rationalizing okay well i don't know i don't care how i <laughs> that's the problem i don't care how i look i really don't this has more effect of yeah wait till i see my wife in a couple of months she's going to be all kinds of like you know 
trying to, you know, cut this, cut that. But I have some support, at least in Cape Town, because I know uh, both uh, Anthony and um, and, uh, and and uh, and what's the name? Uh, damn, I got the brother's face right there. Uh, uh, Emma's husband, uh, uh, Kalori, right? They both have bushy beards, all rough and stuff like that. And I want to, those are my heroes, be like that. I want to be like a wow man kind of guy, you know? Anyway, okay, so let's get this going. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let's get this going. Oh, I need to get it going by putting my glasses on. Okay. Oh, okay, it didn't snap my fingers. I'm good. Okay. No. Ah. I was going to say something. Oh, I know what it was. I know, I know what I'm going to do. It's going to be short. Wow. Well, you know, short. Relatively short. Okay. Live. I'm watching my lips move. Sorry about that. Live now. Oh, hey, Instagram. It's me, T, from the Patterson's taking a change. It's bet. Well, this is going to be short, I swear. I've said that yesterday, and I was short yesterday, wasn't I? I'm going to be short today, too. Okay. Da, 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 da. Look, it's very simple. I've been I'm not obsessed, but lately I've, I've been thinking a lot about joy, the word joy, just joy, because somebody, I'm, I'm drinking some tea. So, uh, oh, I shouldn't be drinking and talking at the same time. I shouldn't be eating and talking. Same time. Sorry. If Instagram, forgive me. I'm going to make like make like that didn't happen. Let's strike that from the record. You, know how, you like the way they say, let's strike that from the record. Oh, really? How do you strike that from somebody's memory? Wait, wait, wait. Here's the thing. I, let, I mean, for some reason, the word joy, it just keeps on, for the last few years, it just keeps on popping up. And I feel so joyous. I don't know. So here's what I do when stuff like that happens. I have to take the word joy. Now, according to numerology, like what you do is like, you know, you have the numbers one through nine, right? And then you have the letters like A is one, you know, B is two, three. Let, oh, you don't see what I'm doing. Don't matter. It's, it's, it's a chart. You can make the chart yourself. That's what I do. So, for instance, my initials, AJS, is what they're all ones, you know, that adds up to three. So that's all. That's nice and with me. I gotta, I'm going up to New York. I'm going to get, I'm going to find Lloyd Strayhorn's book, uh, Numbers and You, because I've had so many copies throughout the years. I don't know. It could be, I could have some copies hidden up here someplace. Original ones. Okay, never mind. Back to the point. So, so you take the word joy, right? So J would be H R uh, H R. Uh, where's J? Oh, J. Oh, J. <laughs> this one. I know that. J is one. O is six, right? And Y is seven, right? So seven, seven is fourteen, right? Seven, seven, fourteen, six, one, six, seven, right? Seven, seven is fourteen. Four and one is five. So joy is an excess of word. It's like excess. Joy. So joy fits right in with what the word, numerologically speaking, I always love to say that word, numerologically speaking. It's like, let me tell you something happened. When I was a kid, not my kid, when I was younger, anyway, when young kids can say my name, Anthony, right? Say Anthony. When they, I mean, young kids, when they get to say it and they realize they can say this Anthony three letter word, I would get this, they would just keep on cascading. <laughs> they keep on saying the name. Well, the same thing what I just said about numer numerologically speaking. When you get those big words and you can say them, a lot of times, you know, you want to use them. Like a word like, I know, I'm still drinking, sorry, man. It's cold out here, it's tea. In fact, uh, did I tell you what tea this is? This is a, this is, I got three tea bags in here, right? I got uh, licorice, I have, a, I have a licorice ginger, a turmeric ginger, and a licorice tea. All in one tea. Because it's cold here in Virginia. Okay, that's actually, actually that's what I was just trying to say. Joyous. You know another big word that I use? I love this word. I use this word all the time. I only heard a few people ever use this word. It's a it's a uh, uh, it's a uh, anthropological term, I think. Anyway, it's autochthonous. 
or Tactitus just means it means it comes from that space, that 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 area. It's better than indigenous. It's a better word than indigenous. So I use autochthonous all the time instead of indigenous. But that's just me, because I'm a contrarian and I like unique things. That's what happens. Okay. But anyway, so so I figured I'm a that that beard I might not do any because I, I no longer have that beard comb, even though I can raise regular regular home. And I'm I'm going to New York. I guess I could see my barber if he's out in the street. Well, I'm going to just keep on because I got to go to Cape Town and I'll see those guys that that, 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 that bush their thing like that. So I might try to join their tribe by bushing it up, you know, not not grooming. Right? Nobody down here going to say anything. By the time I day I go through Cape Town, by the time I get to my wife in the Eastern Cape, right, then she'll be going crazy. So then I have to... You know? Okay. That's it. I just wanted to tell you all that stuff. Just about joy. Joyous. And here's the thing about joy. You don't have to be in this constant state of joy. It's like exercise. I like do these floor exercises where you, you do a few and then you have to rest. Contemplate. I call it contemplating, but you know, you rest. Then they do it. Rest, rest, rest. But that's what it is. You should have spurts in your, in your existence where you're doing stuff and then you take a joyous rest. Appreciate what you just accomplished or, you know, Attempted, you know, and just be joy. And that way, the joy, the, the, the joy increments will, will increase. And so you, you'll be more joyous than other things, you know. So find your joy, okay? I said spread joy, as I said. I, I got to tell you this. No, I won't say that. Anyway, spread joy. I think that's a, um, is that what they said? Oh, my first job in theater. I mean, my first job. Well, no, sorry, my first job in theater was running lights for Daddy Goodness. And I think the tagline there, because it was based on um, Daddy Grace, you know what I mean? The tagline was like, the, 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 they would say, spread joy. The, the congregation would say, the, the greeting would be spread joy. I should bring that back. Spread joy. Okay. I sort of jumped back and forth, man, as usual. I don't know why I do these things. What is this thing that keeps on? Oh, I see. I see this thing on my head, you know. It's a shadow from uh, the hooks that we got here. Oh, well, leave that going. Okay. Let me put my, I'm sorry, man. Hold on. I don't want my head to get cold. I'm just trying to fight this cold. Well, I, I fought it. I won, as usual. Put this on. Okay. First, let's, be, let's, be, let's put the glasses away. Put those away. Do that first. We've got to be neat and clean. All right. Put that away. Put the glasses and the book back into the bag. See how you do this? I do this with children, too, a lot. Then I'll share. Ah, the brother says, spread joy. The brother... Says it's just a red. Oh, uh, the brother says spread joy. I can't say av advocates the spreading of joy. That would <laughs> that would be good. The brother says spread joy. The better, the easier, the whatever says spread. Rocky a spread joy. Sorry. Oh, oh. Well, I'll tell you what I didn't tell the Instagram. I had I had left when I had left anyway I left a, a, one of my I was part of a lot of different crews technological technical technical crews and there was one crew where we we, we I had my I had the, the sound gathers where we recorded you know political stuff but then I was also recording poetry down in the Lower East Side area like that and it was like three of us that were that were very very well respected for for recording that that would be John Fisk who was the master right uh, Dave Nolan. Peace and blessing of his eternal soul, and and me, you know, we we, we record poetry stuff, and, and you know, we record poetry stuff, and and you know, Arab and whatever, so things like that. But the thing is, Dave Nolan uh, uh, married a woman. Her name was Joy, right? and and this is long after well, they married, right? And then when I was leaving, somehow I did, and I wrote this this uh, email, and I said at the end. Uh, advocate everybody say spread joy and so Dave Race plays back hey that's my wife's name <laughs> it was funny at the time it was funny to me okay air location western branch oh, air to series this would be plain old in the morning in the morning 
We're in the mood and had a stress. Uh, we share. Uh, that's getting going. Uh, and uh, that's it. I'll talk to, talk to you all later. I'm still, I mean, I got stuff to do. I'm preparing. I got, okay, I got to, I got to get, eat my breakfast. That's the one thing I got to do. Eat my breakfast, eat my water, I should say. That's going to take a little while because I'm going to use pomegranate. That's way like a chore. Taking a pizza. Anyway, you, you don't, don't worry about it. I'll talk to you uh, tomorrow or some, some later. Listen to, you know, have the, the gullah readings. Yeah, you know, I do a gullah. You know, you know, that, that's, that's religious. I want you all to get all religious. Okay. okay. So I'll uh, talk to you all tomorrow. Bye.